Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For the cheapest and fastest coins anywhere, make sure to check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. Hey guys, I'm gonna be talking to you about the YouTube drop pack, which uh, I'll be honest, I really don't know why I got the pack, or even necessarily how I got the pack, but I'm gonna go over some things that maybe led to us getting these packs here, I, I really don't know, and then we're also gonna open some other packs, trying to pull Ricky Williams. Now, I do wanna give a shout out to Shane for being a part of the Noti Gang, if you guys want a chance to be shout out in the next video, drop a like in the vid, make sure you guys are subs to the channel, turn the notification bell on, and comment down below, Noti Gang. And also guys, don't forget to check out the $500 in Underdog Fantasy credit giveaway I'm currently running, five winners of $100 in Underdog Fantasy credits each, all you guys have to do, is sign up on Underdog Fantasy, using code ZERK to match your first deposit, retweet the tweet, and follow myself and Underdog Fantasy over on Twitter, and that's all you gotta do, by the way, this video should be going up before 7 p.m. So I already posted some college football slips. If you guys are going to copy those, they're up on Twitter. So let's talk about this YouTube drop pack. Now you guys will notice there is nothing here, right? Like it doesn't actually have a pack like card art. But you guys can see right here if I remove my face cam real quick, it says YouTube drop pack. And then on top of us getting this YouTube drop pack, you guys can see that you're also just getting like random cards. Uh, some people got a leech. You guys see this is someone that tweeted at me that it says customer service grant of a Corley Cooper Cup. They also got a Tremaine Edmonds and then a Stadium. Now for myself personally, as you guys can see, uh, we have this 71 overall gold, right? Now it says I got it from a pack opening, but I didn't. It was granted to me. So I don't know what that's about like some people got elites some people got golds i'm thinking that like it was supposed to be a pack i think it was supposed to be a pack that you got but it just like for some reason got sent out to everybody as like opened already and just showed you what cards you would have gotten it and then we also got this mcs ultimate kickoff alternate stadium uh which you guys can see head over to maddenchampionship.com to register and compete for your chance to take home a belt and then on top of that, we have the YouTube drop pack, which I'm going to get into. And I'd be like, Zerk, how do I get this pack? I'll be honest, guys. I honestly have zero clue. I really, really have zero clue. But all I know is that I tweeted out and asked everybody if they got the pack. It seems like the large majority of people did, but there are some people that didn't. And EA hasn't tweeted anything about it. No one has said anything. So I really don't know how you even get the pack. But I will say this. The only thing that I can say is maybe you got this pack if you have your account linked up to Twitch, right? Which I went over this morning. I went over the free Jalen Waddle, right? The 88 overall free Jalen Waddle over here. We are going to be having some MCS streams on the 7th at 6.30 and the 9th at 7 p.m. To watch those streams there to go ahead and get the drops so that way you can get Waddle maybe that is how you get the pack. So I'm going to put a link for you guys at the top of the comment section. You can click on and link those up there, but I really have no clue. So let's go ahead and open up my pack. Now, some people have tweeted me with them pulling like LTDs out of this pack with pulling Ricky Williams. So I don't exactly know what all this pack entails, but we get a headliner. Okay, 77 and another headliner, 78. So my YouTube drop pack, I got four golds, and that was it. But some people got elites, some people got really lucky and pulled like an LTD Ricky, but it's some sort of free pack. So that is the free pack there, and now let's go ahead and get into some other packs and see if we can potentially pull Mr. Ricky Williams. Now, we do have 1,900 training points. By the way, I did upload over on Xerxes 2 guys already a Ricky Williams Michael Crabtree and a Derek Johnson gameplay. So if you guys have not already seen that gameplay, make sure you guys are going to check it out. Tomorrow I plan on doing Tim Tebow and DeMarco Murray and uh 87 LaVisca Chenault. Okay, I will definitely take that. 3,100 training points. I know it's probably better if I would have sold the card, but I'm trying to do some more re-rolls and try to pull that LTD Ricky Williams because he is expensive right now. So let's continue on here with these packs. But as I said, I'm going to be doing that gameplay tomorrow. If there are any other gameplays you guys want to see, let me know. And uh, if at any point in time between when I am uploading this video, right, if EA tweets something out and I post this video without me mentioning here, if you guys see something from EA, 
anywhere about why we got that Twitch drop or how to get the YouTube uh, drop pack, please comment it down below for other people. But the only possible thing that I can think of is having those things connected there because I don't even think my EA account is connected to uh, YouTube. It's just connected to Twitch. So I don't really understand exactly why we all got that pack, why some people didn't get it. Uh, originally, I thought it was for linking. Then some people said they got the pack, but they're not even linked up to Twitch. So then I thought maybe it was pushed out to everybody, but it doesn't seem like everyone has it. Also, I'm sure I'm gonna get people commenting down below asking me about the competitive field pass rewards, like on every single video that I've been posting for the past couple of days. Uh, I have no update. EA hasn't tweeted a single thing, so I have absolutely no idea. But the only thing I can say is what I said this morning, which is we didn't actually think we were going to get anything today. But then at about like 11 o'clock, we did get some rewards. Now, we didn't get all of our rewards, but we did end up getting like a bunch of XP. I think I got like a bunch of coins and everything. I haven't gotten any packs, though, that I deserve or that I've earned. And I haven't gotten everything that I need. Let's get another 87 overall Dark West Dinar right there. Another 87 overall in general. We'll definitely take that. But I'm still missing like 50,000 XP. Like I didn't get that one. I think I got the 25,000 XP reward. Haven't gotten the 50. And as of this very second, guys, that I'm recording this video, I'm literally one Mutt Champs win away from having enough competitive points to get the Woolen. So I really, really want that. Now, my guess here, though, is that we ended up getting the first, like, batch of rewards that they had kind of already worked through. And then hopefully we'll get them either tonight or tomorrow. They did say on the stream this morning they would have an update for us tomorrow on the field pass. So I'm hoping this means that everything is going to be ready and set tomorrow and be done. And then hopefully the issues with the field passes can stop because... It's uh, definitely not fun. But I don't believe we're going to be having any sort of content tomorrow, guys. It is Friday, so tomorrow afternoon, though, we already know this. Yes, there will be a Legend reveal tomorrow afternoon. Uh, last week, they didn't have a Legend reveal until Saturday morning, like right before the Legends actually dropped in the game. But that was just a one-time occurrence, and we should have a Legend reveal tomorrow night, which we have two set Legends, one LTD. I definitely will be having a video going over those cards. Hopefully they're good. To, to be honest, I'm kind of open for a corner. I know that we have, you know, Tariq Woolen to look forward to with a competitive pass, but there are just so many good wide receivers in the game right now, like Justin Jefferson, Randy Moss, uh, Michael Crabtree. I feel like they're really, really outmatching the cornerbacks right now, which happens at times throughout the years in Madden. They just always like to have a super OP wide receiver, but I would really like to see another cornerback to kind of address that situation there and not the limited i want it to be like a set one so that it's not a ridiculous amount of coins but aside from that i don't think there's anything coming tomorrow so hopefully field pass would be good to go i'll get my 89 overall uh bnd all madden player excited for that and hopefully i'll be able to get my Tariq woolen tomorrow and maybe do a gameplay with that card as well so with that being said guys i hope you did enjoy the video and if you did make sure you guys drop a like on it and of course hit that sub button down below again i am not entirely sure how we ended up getting this uh youtube drop pack they haven't said a thing about it but if you happen to know i guess comment down below but let's end this video off here with an elite pack i've been doing a lot of rerolls, so kind of want to do an elite pack and see if we can get something glitchy here we get a 82 Deontay that'll be it hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and if you did check these out